Jerry Osborne. I'm president of KUKA Robotics in the U.S. We're based in Shelby Township, Michigan, which is about 40 miles northeast of Detroit. Today we're having an open house, but we're celebrating the grand opening of our Metal and Arc Technical Center. The customer base in the Detroit area is, is heavy on automotive and, the, of course, the associated suppliers. And so the Metal and Arc Tech Center is really designed to support those customers. But there are also a lot of small manufacturing, fabrication companies in the area that can benefit from this as well. The Metal and Arc Tech Center should be a kind of a communication platform. We want to bring in here our customers, our technology partners, as well as our end users. And we're building the bridge and the divisions throughout those group to our KUKA organization. So it's all about here demonstrating the capability of our products and making sure with feasibility studies their projects work well. The tech center is this place where we can take those customer challenges and work on them. We can investigate them and come up with solutions. The tech center concept now is a global thing. Today we're celebrating the metal and arc or welding tech center here in Shelby Township, but we've got tech centers in the west coast of the United States, in Canada, and of course in Asia, there's a growing need for more and more application solutions for the customer there, and equally in Europe, where again, we're close to our key customers. I actually see the tech centers as a benefit, uh, not only to uh, the local customers, but customers that uh, you know have applications, they have some place that they can come, they can talk to somebody about their project, they can do testing. Uh, the benefit for us, obviously, is you know having our end effectors on the robots in your training center, introduces them to Shunk as an option for their, their end effector needs. We um, can really test out cycle times. Uh, our ultra light gun is what we have here, and it's really to get smaller footprints. So being able to see that, work with lighter robots, lighter uh, weld guns as well, to increase manufacturing um, proficiency, it really helps give our customers that option and to get hands-on with our equipment. The idea behind Ready to Use is primarily for system integrators, so we provide a robot with some sort of device on it. It might be a screwdriver, it might be a welding package, it might be a spot welding gun. The idea is to make it easier uh, to provide a standardized solution so that the, the integrator doesn't have to spend time and resources developing something that's fairly standard. The Ready to Use product essentially arrives at the customer, as the name implies, ready to use. That means that these difficult jobs that don't really add any value to the, to the robot system are already done, which allows the customer essentially to start production more quickly, to get into production more quickly. And equally, it allows him to scale up or down depending on his need and clearly to supply globally the same product again and again. The customer can bring actually, the integrator can bring in his value of programming, of fixture, of, of process know-how, of setting up a systems rather than wasting their time with putting packages together. The mobile products are important for KUKA because we see the future in that. So we see that automation has to get more flexible so, and for that you will need mobilities because the robots today, they are just ground on the floor so they cannot move but with the mobiles you can be much more flexible. I think the benefit for the customer goes beyond ROI. Um, a lot of companies today struggle about to find enough workers to do this work. So um, if they can free worker time, that's good for them. And with the mobiles you can now automate tasks you did not think about before. Orange Intelligenz.